Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Five Nights at Freddy's video. I don't know who, um... I've seen, a, I, I've seen this guy before. I've seen this guy before talking about something else. But this is top 10 facts about Balloon Boy, Five Nights at Freddy's. So I don't know what the fuck Balloon Boy is, F Five Nights at Freddy's, I've heard of this. I, to be honest, I don't know what a lot of stuff is because I, I either haven't watched a lot of it or I just don't care. Like, I watch like very limited shows or movies. Oh, Five Nights at Freddy's is a video game. Why the fuck did I think it was a show? Oh, that's so creepy. Ew. Five Nights at Freddy's is an American media franchise created by whatever the fuck. It began with the 2014 video game and has since gained popularity, worldwide popularity. Damn. So we're going to talk about Balloon Boy specifically from Five Nights at Freddy's. I don't know who the fuck that is, but top 10 facts about Balloon Boy. So... Hopefully I don't need to watch the or play the actual game to make to understand this because like, I have I don't I don't play video games usually. I play very limited games. I watch very limited shows. Like I'm very boring. Like I'm not exciting at all. I'm sorry guys. I'm just not. <laughs> anyway guys, I'll put in the dis or I'll put in the description and in the video who suggests this video, assuming I can find it. And of course, let me know if you have any other suggestions, and I'll get to them within a year. <laughs> Let's just say that within a year I'll get to them. Okay. Um. But yeah, top 10 facts about Balloon Boy. Before we get started, be sure to give this video a like at the end of the video. At the end of the video, if you guys do end up enjoying it, be sure to comment down below what your thoughts are at the end of this video. And once again, suggest anything that you guys want. And please consider subscribing as well and turning on post notifications. Without further ado, we are able to start now. Let's go. Hey guys, it's Mike here, and this is the top 10 facts about BB. Now this video was uploaded before, but it had fan art in it, so I had to remove it. So here is the video without fan art. So please, enjoy. Hey, what's up guys, it's Mike here, and today I'm going to be showing you the top 10 facts about Balloon Boy in Five Nights at Freddy's. Yeah, so he, let's he, jump right into it. Yeah, he number 10 himself, is that Balloon Boy is actually the only humanoid animatronic, which means that he is the only one that represents a human, and also he is the only animatronic to have a fully clear, non-distorted human voice playing with his voice box. And yeah, not only does he represent a human, cool. he represents a human child, and also, unlike any other animatronic, he actually has clothes. And then for fact number 9 is that BB is officially hands down the most hated animatronic in the whole game. In fact, oh. people hate him so much that he has actually earned the nickname Fuckboy. And of course the reason oh. why people hate him so much okay. is because, well first of all, he's always taunting you. And second of all, since he's not aggressive, the way he quote unquote attacks you the way is he not looks by actually jump scaring you. But the rather by simply removing your ability to use your flashlight, which is very frustrating and leaves you prone to being attacked by Foxy. And after number 8 we have a pretty mysterious one, which is actually not known by many people. You know how BB has these two buttons on his shirt? Well you see the color of these buttons is black, and it's pretty much always black, whether you shine your flashlight on it or not. Yeah. However, for some unknown reason, when BB enters your office, his shirt buttons all of a sudden become white. Now, it is unclear whether this is a technical mistake accidentally left by Scott Cawson, or if Scott purposely left this in the game and it actually means something. I don't know, you guys tell me what you think of this in the comment section. And after number 7, we have one that I only recently sort of figured out, and that is that the mysterious disappearing paper plates dude in the second game actually represents Balloon Boy. I mean, think about it, it's the only one that actually seems to represent a humanoid character, because unlike the other paper plates, this one doesn't have any ears or anything like that. And also, the other paper plates uh, have, have these like sort of black eyes buttons. because that's how their endoskeleton eyes look, while this one has more human blue eyes. Now, who else has blue eyes? BB. And also, just like BB, he has blue pants. And of course, finally, he has a few black buttons on his shirt, just like BB. And then for fact number six Damn. is that there's actually an alternate version of Balloon Boy that sometimes appears under your he, table. He's under the this test. version of Balloon Boy has been often dubbed by the fan community as pink Balloon eyes. Girl because this version has pink eyes, more rosy cheeks, and also the color pattern of its hat is blue and purple rather than being yeah, that blue seems and like red. A, a girl and BB. finally doesn't have any sort of fan more thing B, on its uh, head. BG, and then for girl. fact number five is you know how Balloon Boy holds a balloon sign in his left hand as well as a balloon in his right hand man that's a lot of balloons well actually once he enters the vent he loses both his sign and his balloon for some reason and as soon as he's out of the vent both his balloon and his sign uh, match that just sounds creepy this is gonna give me fucking nightmares yeah, or just some like shit with the mysterious black gray uh shirt buttons it's unclear whether this was just a technical sort of mistake by scott or if it's something paranormal Ooh. <laughs> 
Another fact number four is that okay. if you zoom into BB's mouth, you will see that there's something inside of him. It's unclear exactly what that is. I mean, it does kind of look like eyes or something, but then again, why would his eyes be so low? And also what's even more bizarre is that when BB is present in the vents, this thing disappears. And not only that, but if you flash your light into BB when he's in the vents, you'll see that there's actually absolutely nothing present in his head. I mean, it's completely empty, it doesn't even have any endoskeleton or anything. And then for fact number three is that BP looks fairly similar to uh, the villager from Animal Crossing. The, the villager that? has actually as a fuck. reputation for looking very psychotic with his permanent smile yeah, I, I and can see his that. wide open eyes. Fuck. Very much like BP to the point where it's actually possible that the villager could have been uh, somewhat of an inspiration for BB. And also notice the significance between their noses. They have pretty much the exact same nose, both being very triangular. And that's number two, the same that character, I find it's just psycho mouth. Which is that BB is the only animatronic that is never mentioned by the phone guy. Wait, what? Isn't the phone guy supposed to be, you know, your guide, your tutorial for the game? You know, isn't it supposed to be his responsibility to inform you of all animatronics and teach you their behaviors? Well, one possible explanation for this is that BB could have possibly been added sort of very late in development after Scott recorded all the voices and so Scott didn't bother to change any of the voice files just for him and we can just end it there. However, I'm not satisfied with that answer. I think there's another much more probable explanation for this, which leads me to fact number one. There's actually a theory that BB isn't real and that he's just a hallucination. I mean, think about it. First of all, he doesn't attack you and so therefore he doesn't actually do any physical harm. Second of all, like I just said, the phone Earlier guy never the mentioned video, him, he said which he attacks is suspicious. You. And then third of all, he never appeared in any of the mini games. And of course, let's not forget all the weird inconsistencies that I mentioned on this list. But yeah, otherwise, this theory goes pretty deep, and I won't have time to cover the whole thing on this video. So you know what? You guys tell me in the comment section below if you'd like me to make a whole separate video dedicated to this one uh, sort of theory. Hey there, thanks for watching my top 10 Balloon Boy Facts video. Uh, if you want to see more videos from me, why not subscribe? Okay, I'm good. <laughs> Anyways, um, that was my reaction to top 10 facts about BB. And apparently BG, because apparently there's also a balloon girl. Um, yeah, so in the end, he said that, uh, he doesn't attack you, but then in the beginning, I'm pretty sure he says, yeah, he, like, he comes at you, or he attacks you, so make up your fucking mind. Is he, uh, does he attack you or not? I don't know. I haven't played this game. I don't even know what the fuck this shit is. So, I don't know anything about this. All I know is that it looks cre cre creepy as fuck, and if I see him anywhere in a game, I'm just gonna fucking go the other way. Because, it's like, just seeing him and stuff just reminds me of It, and I think that because, you know, Balloon... Hold, hold, holding a sign named Balloons, his face looks fucking creepy. It just kind of makes me think of it, so. Just makes me think of it. With that being said, that's it. <laughs> that's the end of this video. If you guys did enjoy it, be sure to give it a like. Be sure to comment down below what you guys thought of this video. Do you guys have any comments, concerns, anything? I don't know what the fuck you'd be concerned about, but yeah, let me know in the comments below what you guys think. Um, let me know if you have any other suggestions as well. And... What else? I guess that's a, a subscribe. Consider subscribing if you're new and uh, turn on post notifications. And yeah, with that being said, that's basically it. Nothing else for me to really say. So I appreciate you guys watching, and I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. Peace out, deuces, peace, bye.